Whoa! Whoa, oh, well, do bad attack! Help me! Yo, what's up, guys? It is Super Electivire here, and welcome to a Pokemon Ash Gray Nuzlocke video thing. But today, we are going to be challenging the first gym for the second time, I believe. And, um, a couple things I need to say. I guess I'll say it during the gym battle. Um, oh, the first thing, let's do a team update. Everybody's level 30. What happened is that I ended up just watching Tyranitar Tubes, um, I forgot what it was. Probably his Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. And I ended up grinding, and I was like, oh my gosh, everybody's ready to level 30, except Butterfree. Or Pikachu or whoever it was, I don't even remember. And I was like, oh, okay, um, I'm just gonna go watch some Pokemon anime. And while I grind up the last guy, because I think, I think it was Butterfree and he was like level 22. So I'm like, okay, I need to get to at least level 25. So I ended up watching the anime and then, oh my gosh, I'm already level 30. Like, what? So I accidentally grinded to level 30. I meant to do 25, but that's okay. Um, got Confusion, Gust. Flying type move, which is nice. Confusion um, is awesome as, as well. Psychic type move, and we've got um, Sleep Powder and Poison Powder. So those are really good moves. We've actually got Wing Attack on um, Pidgeotto now, and Tackle and Quick Attack. I kept Sand Attack just in case we needed it for this um, battle. But Pikachu gets Thunderbolt, 95 base power, level 26. Uh, slam as well, Quick Attack, and Thunder Wave. So, apparently Electric type moves work on Ground type moves if you're holding the Light Ball. I'll need to try that, but I'm gonna go with my strategy, put him to Sleep, Sand Attack, and then go with the Thunder Bolt. And, I should be completely fine, he's only level 14. Well, haven't you learned your lesson? Your Pikachu is no match for me. I have a Butterfree. Oh, and I also ran damage calculations. My, all my Pokemon can take at least one, and Pikachu can take more, of course. Rock uh, Tomb, I believe. No, Rock Throw. I forgot. You might think you're ready to challenge me, but I can tell you're still a novice. I must accept all challenges, so let the match begin. Your Butterfree's no match for me. I'm, I ran calculations, and I'm pretty sure all my Pokemon can take at least... Wait, what? Wait. 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 Why does he have a Geodude? Well, I mean, I can understand them wanting to make it easier, but... Wow, this was overkill. Alright, whatever. I think you should just be able to, like, one-shot this thing or something. Maybe I should just... Oh, maybe Geodude gets a, a ground-type move. Maybe that's why. No, but Onyx gets ground-type moves, too. Uh, whatever. Let's just go into Pika. Pika, Pika! And uh, I'm just gonna use this extra turn to try out Thunderbolt, then. Oh my gosh, it works! Is it only when you hold Light Ball though? Oh, that animation's awesome. Oh my gosh! Well, I think this is gonna be really easy. Alright! Huh, Pikachu's electricity is set off the sprinklers! Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh! Oh, so he sends out Geodude, because now he has two Pokemon, so now you have so you have Geodude, and then now you're supposed to fight Onyx. And, okay. Leave Onyx alone, our brother raised it. You worked hard to raise it, you big bully. This stuff on all of you. This is an official match, and we're going to finish it no matter what. Alright. But now I don't have Pikachu in anymore. Oh, okay, I get it. Alright. Now he's got his level 14 Onyx. Alright. Working hard to raise it. Haha, <laughs> nice. Honestly, rain doesn't help at all, I don't think, unless he's got, like, an ability that, like, Oh, your attack and defense are lowered by 30% when, when you're in the rain or something. I don't, I don't see how the rain's gonna help um, in, in, in the actual game. But let's just use the same strategy. I should be able to do some major damage to the Sonix. That's insane. That's insane. I did not expect it to do that much. I don't even know if I'm gonna stick Brock in the title because... I don't think that's gonna work. Because this is just such an anticlimactic battle. It just overpower everybody. Level 30. Gosh. Gosh. 1 KO. Oh my gosh. Alright. 
Nice. It's gonna be hard to level up now. Well, I took you for granted and so I lost. Not really, I just trained up too much. Well, I gave you the boulder badge. Da da da. Bomb. Alright, just having the boulder badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. That's great. Wait, take this with you. Whoa, well, TM39. Hey, it contains a technique. And, oh, you can use it as many times as you want. Rock Tomb. Wait, really? 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 I want to become the world's best breeder. Running eggs on the battle resort until I die. I can't leave here, but I want you to take the boulder badge and fulfill my dream. Wait, but you're supposed to go with us. Rock, you can go follow your own dreams. My father. I couldn't become the great Pokemon trainer I wanted to, and because I was such a failure, I was too ashamed to go back to my family. But it's time I started taking careful care of my family. Rock, you may go fulfill your dreams. And so then it's time to become the breeder. Thank you for everything. Bye. Well, I've decided to watch over my children from now on and let Brock pursue his dreams. So you're gonna sit there and block my exit so I have to run through the gravel or whatever. Oh yeah, there's also no, uh, that dude who sits in front. Right here. And he goes, Hey, champ in the making! <laughs> Alright, but, so, so, I guess neither Brock or Misty follow us then. So, that's kind of weird. Um, I don't even need to heal, I might as well just heal for PP. Uh, I'm sure I'm gonna be fine though, but Wait, so I got a TM and you're allowed to use TMs as much as you want, huh? There are actually I don't even know if there are any TMs in the anime. I, I don't recall ever seeing one, but let's take a look um, Oh, yeah, I bought I, I found a potion on the ground. That's the other thing. Uh, so I actually have a TM case Where did I get that? Uh, it only has 80 accuracy. I thought it was 95 Maybe they changed it. Oh, none of my Pokemon can learn it anyways. But So apparently TMs can be used many times, so hopefully that's correct. And also, Brock, you couldn't tell, but your dad was in front of the city this entire time. But we're at Route 3, and we could probably catch a Pokemon. I know the grass patch is way all the way at the end of the route to the right. Did you come through the Viridian Forest? Not really, I came through the Pewter City thing. I wonder if I can speed up these battles. I don't know how- I forgot how to do- oops, I've got on it. It doesn't even matter. Yeah, I think that- I think I just sped up the battle, okay. Cool. That'll make things a lot faster. You guys don't mind the change in audio, right? I, I don't think so. I don't put it very high anyway, so I, I don't even know if you guys can hear it, so it's fine. I mean, I, I try to make sure that when I'm editing the video, I try to make sure that you guys can hear the audio, but just not to the point where it overpowers my voice, because I don't have that great of a- uh, speaking voice and stuff, so... I'll, I'll probably just get rid of the speeding up um, when I walk, just basically only for the battles. I think that, that'll that work. Oh, he's got a Fiji. Let's make it confused. Wait, how is this guy level 9? They only have one... Oh, okay, no. She has a couple, never mind. But she has two level 9 Pidgeys, whereas the other guy had three... three bug types that were all level 10. So he, generally, when they have more Pokemon, then they have less... Uh, abilities, which is weird. There's just a ton of trainers here. I wish they would let us train here, and Flint doesn't make you like do all that stuff. Ooh, youngster Ben with that Rotata. Oh gosh. But I, I, actually, Gus probably does more. So I get stabbed from it, but whatever. Ooh, Ekins, Ekins. All right. Ooh, with that Intimidate, but that doesn't even matter because all my moves are special. But that's cool. That's cool. But yeah, I, I, I wish they let you train here. Couldn't cut it. Because training here, there's so many trainers here, I would've, eh, yeah, yeah, I'm kind of mixed about this, because if I train here, then I have to show it on screen as well, but that's probably fine, I don't mind. I'm gonna run out of all these confusion, they all have so many low level. well, I mean, they're technically not low leveled. I'm just like super high level. but, um, I can't believe summer's almost over. <laughs> I mean, I know a lot of people are already going to school, which really sucks, but, you know, that stuff. But we should be able to catch a Pokemon here. Um, I'm not sure what I can actually get. I will be using the duplicate clause, which basically says that um, if you get a Pokemon that you've already caught or that's in your evolution line, 
then you don't need to catch it. You can go catch a different Pokemon that you haven't caught yet. So that makes it a lot easier so you don't end up with like a team of like six Butterfree uh, like at the beginning of the game, which can be really uh, annoying. Oops, I accidentally used Gust. But yeah, I will be using the Dupes Claws. It's basically short for Dupes Claws. I, I couldn't even figure that out until I, figured, until I was like, Dupes Claws. Dupes Claws. Dupes Claws. And then I finally realized that it's a duplicate clause, and that made so much more sense. My Pokemon likes to suck blood. Oh no, is it a Zubat? It's a Zubat, guys. Oh gosh, level 14 Zubat. Level 14 Zubat. Level 14. Okay, it's dead. Oh, thank goodness. Gosh, why do they already have Zubats? I mean, I can understand because uh, Mount Moon actually has Zubats as well, so. Alright, let's beat this trainer and then go catch a Pokemon. Now, the awesome thing is that I have a Butterfree, which means it can put Pokemon to sleep. Because my Pokemon are all so overleveled that, oh gosh, here's the Menace itself, Jigglypuff, and then there's Zubat over there. These two trainers, level 14. But yeah, my Jigglypuff, or I mean, <laughs> not my Jigglypuff, my Butterfree has all those extra status moves, which makes it really helpful when catching a Pokemon. And also, Pikachu has Thunder Wave, which is nice. Oh, okay. Well, I use Dupes Claws. I kill Pidgey. How about we do something like if I use the dupes claws, then I have to kill them. That, that would, I feel like that is better. I mean, but then running away wouldn't be so bad either. I use dupes claws. I use confusion. Yeah, I, I don't know if that makes any sense, but you know, having to battle them, I don't know if that's logical or if that if that's if that's even gonna matter much. Spear. Oh god. Well, I have to use dupes claws. So, gotta kill the Spearow, but, oh man, gosh, have to, I'm hoping for like a Nidoran Vemo, because I don't even know what's here, oh, Nid awesome, Nidoran Male, oh, but that means like he can't get poisoned, uh, sleep should work, it's only level 6, I'm not sure how low the catch rate is, or how high the catch rate is, um, if you guys don't know, catch rate is easier to catch when it is higher, so you want a higher catch rate, generally the stuff at the beginning has a higher catch rate, than the stuff at the end, especially legendaries have like catch rate. Oh my gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Okay, let's just go. I have ten. I have like eleven more Pokeballs, so this is my only shot. I'm too overloved to catch anything. So, gosh! Shoot! It was so close too. This guy's sleeping. Come on, you're just supposed to sit in the Pokeball. Now, I know Nidor and Male is actually harder to catch than a, like a lot, like Pidgey or something. It's got a lower catch rate. Gosh. He used Leer. Oh, I'm scared. My defense just fell. Alright, let's put him in sleep again. I mean, I have Compound Eyes, which means I can hit Sleep Powder most of the time, which is really nice. I'm a really big fan of Compound Eyes because it's like the thing that Vivalon runs, actually, for Sleep Powder. I love Vivalon so much. It's got a uh, Hurricane, Bug Buzz, um, Sleep Powder, and Quiver Dance. So what you do is you put the opponent to sleep. No, come on, Nidoran, get in the stinking Pokeball. I only have to nine more or something. Yeah, so basically you just put the opponent to sleep and then you just set up Quiver Dances as they switch or as they stay in. And if they stay in, then you get to set up usually one or two. Thank you. Usually you get to set up one or two quiver dances if they switch. Usually just one, which is fine. Um, but sometimes they only sleep for one turn, so you know it's not even it's not even that great. Um, what should I name this thing? No. Uh. Uh, I got nothing. <laughs> Horns would have been awesome, but nah. I'm just gonna name him Horn Drill because of that. Because you know, the people who set, um, like, records for the fastest Pokemon Red, you know, um, the fastest Pokemon Red times, I guess, there's like world records for that. I know that they usually like to use one a KO Pokemon, like they just like go get a Nidor and Male as soon as they can, and then they just use, they just evolve it, get a Horn Drill, and then they just like spam Horn Drill the entire thing because in Generation One it was the, it was uh, based off of level, remember? So the higher level you were than the opponents, then you can use the one hit KO moves a lot um, with more, with higher accuracy. So they ended up basically just having one Pokemon so that they get all the experience. And it basically just get, basically ends up with like 100% accuracy because this level is so much higher than everybody else's. So 
it, it makes it so much faster to actually get to the game, which is why they all use it. Now, I'm gonna go train up this Nidoran. Um, Nidoran male, I guess. So, let's put Horn Drill at the very front of the party. Actually, let me check out his moves. Uh, Gentle Nature, Leer and Peck. Wow, almost every single one of them Pokemon has a flying move. That's so weird, except Pikachu. That's weird. That's weird. Oh, I like this song, actually. There's actually a remix by uh, the Eevee EP or whatever. I like that remix. Ooh, my dogs are barking. You should... Wait, is there no Pokemon Center here? This guy just heals? Why is there grass everywhere? So much grass everywhere. Whoa! Ooh, a wild Zubat attack! Help me! Well, Brock usually catches this Zubat, right? I'm pretty sure he catches this Zubat. Oh, there's no hidden items. Alright. If this was Emerald and Ruby, there would be a secret base right here. And there's also Rock Climb there, so I'm, I'm assuming there's like an item there. Melt Moon Tunnel Entrance. ZZ! Oh, I can catch this. I think I have to catch this, right? I have to catch a Zubat. Alright, well... Well, oh gosh. I'm not... Oh, this is gonna suck. Ugh, astonish. Okay, no leech. Oh my... Oh gosh, that did so much damage. That did so much damage. Uh, let's go with Peck. Don't kill me! Oh, that did nothing. How did the first one do so much damage? Oh gosh, here he comes. Confusion leads to life. Gosh. At least it's only recover... It's only, I, um, I resisted, so it's only gonna recover him 1 HP. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Okay, good. Honestly, if I could catch this guy, though, that would be really helpful, because I'm not sure if I would use him, but it would be a good poison-type replacement in case Horn Drill dies. Of course, I don't want Horn Drill to die, because it gets that ground typing, and I'm kind of lacking that ground typing. Just don't crit. Seriously, don't crit. Actually, uh, if, Leech Life, if Leech Life crits, it's not too bad. But I, I need to get, um... I need to, I need to keep Horn Drill for the ground typing. Now, let me just... I'm, I'm running out of Pokeballs already. I only have eight. That's not good. Um, there's still two routes. There's Mount Moon, and then there's the, um, what do you call it? There's the, uh, that one route in between, uh, Cerulean City and Mount Moon. So there's about two more routes left. Uh, so that, that's gonna be, um, they don't have ad accents. Whatever. No accents. And for those who don't know, antipatico is in Spanish, and it means annoying! Freaking annoying. Okay. But I don't plan on using Zubat. Uh, I, I plan on using um, Pidgeotto and um, Nidoran. So I'm just going to leave him in my party. I'm going to just trash him in a PC somewhere <laughs> when I get the chance. It's serious. Inner focus, leech life, and a stun. Oh! Oh, no supersonic! Haha, <laughs> more hacking there, love it. <laughs> they got rid of supersonic. Thank you so much! My name is Seymour the Scientist. Somebody is strung lights up in Mount Moon, causing the nocturnal Pokemon to fly out. They're after the Moonstone. Oh, it's brought from another planet by Clefairy. That's right, Clefairy are aliens. Please go help the aliens. Alright. I think we could also catch a Pokemon here too, right? So, whoa, whoa! Don't battle me. Oh, gee, what well, brought my electric type Pokemon to light light up the tunnel? Is this guy like a bad scientist or something? Super nerd, Hoven. Well, oh gosh, Magnemite. Wait, why? Are Oh, I forgot. I'm, I'm, I'm technically under level. Let's just go with Pikachu. Um, actually, Electric's not very good against Electric, I think. So this is still going to be not very effective. But that's okay. Thunderbolt! Pikachu use Thunderbolt. Actually, I wonder. Actually, I wonder. Because all of these scripts say Thundershock or Thunderbolt, right? In the anime, it's always Thunderbolt or Thundershock, right? But I already forgot Thundershock, I think. So... Is Pikachu still going to use Thundershock even though I forgot it? I mean, is, is that how it's going to work? And I'm not sure about that because, yeah, I, I forgot Thundershock, so how's that going to work? 
Like, like, what if you're... Because I'm not supposed to have Thunderbolt yet, right? I'm not supposed to be level 30. Um, or 26, whichever one you want to count. So, how is that going to work? I don't know. I'm not... I'm not sure. Um, Mount Moon looks so much different, it's nice. I, I like these lights. Ooh, Pokeball. Zubat. Alright. Time to battle. So these guys don't have Supersonic, which makes it so much easier. So maybe they're not as annoying after all. I haven't used Pidgeotto yet, so let's go ahead and use Pidgeotto. Alright. These guys only have Leech Life and Astonish, which... I still... Yeah, I mean, I can't understand why the um, hackers of this, Metapod, whatever, 23, I think? I can understand why he would want to get rid of Supersonic, because that just makes this so much easier. But I'm not sure whether they're going to learn it later, or if they just can't get Supersonic at all. Because if they can't get Supersonic at all, then that means they can't, you know, live. Because <laughs> they use Echolocation, right? Psych Up, that's weird. Psych Up is now a Psychic type move, I think. But I thought it was still Psychic in, in Generation 3, but I guess not. That's weird. Or maybe it still is a normal type, and I just don't know. And I never, I never see or use Psych. Sandshrew! Cool! That's cool. I, I, maybe they must have edited that in, because I'm pretty sure you can't get Sandshrew here normally. But that's cool. But, yeah, yeah, I still don't know whether it's, uh, Psych Up is a Psychic or Normal. I'm pretty sure at some point it changed to Psychic, I'm not entirely sure. Oh nice, level 8 already! Focus to Energy, alright, I'm never gonna use that, am I? Not really. Why is there a Bug Catcher in here? Weird couple just came through here demanding if I knew where the Moonstone was. Oh, okay. So maybe these scientists and stuff, they're all, um, they're all like, they're, they're not bad. They're not part of Team Rocket, right? I don't think so. Uh, I have to switch out against a Weedle. Oh, gosh. I just realized this guy can poison me. Okay, good. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Because poison is like the deadliest thing when you're inside of a cave. Like, it's so deadly. Just because you're gonna die. Um, I believe I still have a couple antidotes. I think I have like two or three, so that's nice. But, oh gosh. I think I'm just gonna make this faster and just walk through. Um, I'm gonna go explore this whole first floor first, so. Oh, nice! Paris! I love Paris. Paris is one of those. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't say I like Paris, it's just. Oh gosh! Yeah, that's it. I'm running away from all Paris's and. And all the, um. Well, I mean, there are no Weedles in here, so only only with the bug catchers. But oh gosh, because Paris is just—I don't know. It, I, I I don't know why I like Paris. It's just kind of actually—I don't even know if I can run away. Okay, good. But um, run, running away is such a—it's such a painful calculation. Wait, there's two ways up. Oh, wait, what? Why did that other bug catcher say it was the other way? Okay then. Prepare for trouble, twerp! We want the Moonstone power of our Pokemon! Ready or not, here we come! Okay, so I'm assuming this is still gonna be a double battle. Ekans? Oh. Why would you not make this a double battle? Okay, I can totally see how this game is gonna be hard. Cause if I wasn't level 30, I would be freaking out right now. Just seeing that level 15 Ekans freaks me out. And I'm level 30. Which is weird, but I still don't see why they can't do a double battle. They did a, if they did the double battle that one time uh, in the in the Pokemon Center when you weren't even guaranteed to have a Pokemon. Why should they do a double battle? Why shouldn't they do a double battle here? I mean, it doesn't make any sense. Let's just keep using uh, Pidgeotto though. I, I actually like Pidgeotto. It's pretty nice. I would have liked to use Spiro too because I just like Spiro so much more than Pidgeotto. Oh, uh, Pidgeot. But I like Mega Pidgeot. What did I tell you about poison being sucky? What did I tell you? Gosh. Not to use an antidote. Come on. Have you guys ever actually just like when you're poisoned and you have roost, just go walk around keeping the poison and, ju and just like when you enter a battle then you use roost <laughs> and then you run away and then you keep walking and then you enter a battle and you use roost? It's time Team Rocket Blast it off. You may have won this round but we'll be back. I need to use that antidote. So much stuff here. Oh, I have five. Perfect. Let's go ahead and use that. Zoom in. 
Antidote was used. Cure the poisoning. Awesome. Alright, where do I start? Why is there... Wait, can you encounter wild Pokemon here? In the grass area? Why is there a random grass patch inside of this cave? Why the heck? What the... But I don't think you can encounter Pokemon in here, which is really cool. Um, I'm assuming you can't swim in this one either, though. Because, yeah, it's too strong to swim in. I, I don't get this. I don't get this game. Well, I'm here to catch some cave-dwelling Pokemon. Well, I'm here to leave. I mean, I'm not... Youngster Josh with the Rattata. Well, I'm not a fan of caves, really. Um, just, I don't like wild Pokemon popping up every five seconds. But then again, I don't like grass either. So, I don't know what I like. I mean, it's just kind of... Yeah, I don't, I don't like random wild Pokemon popping up unless, unless you are um, trying to catch a Pokemon. <laughs> if you're trying to catch it, then yeah, by all means, all the Pokemon come out, come out, come out, whenever you are, wherever you are. Uh, but oh gosh, but I could just probably just quick attack everybody. It's probably still gonna want to kill. But yeah, those boss fights are gonna be everywhere, which kind of sucks. We we'll need more Pokemon. Eh, probably. You probably just need to train them. Or I'm just too overloaded. I'm gonna trust. Oh man, I do have to come back, don't I? I have to come back. Come on, man. I don't want to come back. I don't want to come back. Seriously. Wait, could you just like skip the entire Team Rocket boss fight? No, 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 you can't. Never mind. It's over here. Might be an item here. Nope, no item there. That sucks. Uh, let's just get through this battle really quick. Why is there a Pidgey in here? Why is there a Pidgey in here? Okay, that peck is doing nothing right now. I'm gonna go switch out. <laughs> I like how Pidgey doesn't have peck, it only has sand attack and tackle. And I have peck, and it's a flying type move, and the Pidgey doesn't even have a flying type move. So, so weird. No item there either. Gosh, they have no hidden items in this game. Like, why are there Pidgey here? That makes no sense. I don't... Birds don't live in caves, do they? I'm pretty sure that's only bats. Or am I just, like, that dumb? Am I just that dumb? Hopefully I can get out. I'm trying to end this episode really quick. Nope. It's nice up here, isn't it? Well... Oh, Clefairy! Nice! I'm 14, jeez. Well, I'm probably gonna end up the episode after this battle. Come on! Yep, after this battle. Uh, it's probably around like 20, 30 minutes, so 25, 30 minutes, something like that, so I'm gonna end up the episode. I am, gosh, Brock was so easy. Oh, gosh. Okay, but that's it for today. Leave a like if you enjoyed and you want to keep watching me fail. It's kind of not really fun when I'm level 30 and I want to kill everything. But subscribe if you want to keep seeing this. And Horn Drill is going to be leveling up a lot. So we just beat up Iris. So I'm going to end off this episode again, as I said, like six times. So thank you guys for watching. And see you guys later.